We are gathered here today to sip some tea, honey. So make sure you guys have your tea cups ready because this tea is what? Piping hot. Hey you guys, it's your girl T. I hope you guys are doing good today. Make sure you guys have your tea cups ready because this tea is what? Piping hot. So anyways, everybody's favorite blue-eyed biracial is back in the news. And no, I'm not talking about felon babe Jeremy Meeks. I'm talking about fake pro-black Jesse Williams. <laughs> so anyways, Jesse Williams is back in the news. And the reason why he's back in the news is because everything I told you guys a few months ago has come to pass. And now we have proof that he is with Minka Kelly, okay? So what's going down is that basically... I told you guys a while back that Jesse and his wife were going through a divorce and the divorce is getting kind of tumultuous and now they're fighting over custody. And basically now he's going public. So basically on Jay-Z's footnotes video for his track 444, which was released on Monday, Jesse Williams is on there and he's basically talking about his relationship. So this is what he says. He says, I was in a 13 year relationship, 13 real years, not five years, not seven years, 13 years. And all of a sudden, motherfuckers are writing think pieces that I somehow threw away a 13-year relationship, like the most painful experience I've ever had in my life, like with the person I love with all in my heart, that I threw a person and my family in the trash because a girl I work with is cute. So after that went viral yesterday, now all of a sudden, Jesse and Minka Kelly had been caught together. So today, photos surfaced from TMZ. Um, basically, they were trying to be super low key and they were out in public together. They were on a date night. They went to go watch a movie in West Hollywood and they were both spotted together sporting baseball caps. And Jesse added a hoodie as he left the movie theater. So again, like I told y'all, that blind item revealed everything back in January when people were saying that they were spotting them out in Paris together. They were supposedly supposed to be filming on set and they look really lovey-dovey and holding hands so yeah I mean after 13 years do people grow apart yes you can grow apart after 13 years you know but again it's really sad how she really helped him come up you know she helped the family down while he was pursuing acting and anybody knows if you're trying to get into acting there's a lot more no's than there is yes it takes people years to finally get their big break and so while he was pursuing and working hard she was literally holding down the family financially and then once he actually blows up and everybody knows his name and he's on Grey's Anatomy and now you know he's making good money now all of a sudden it's time to upgrade the damn wife, okay? That's how I'm looking at it. You know, Mika Kelly, you know, she's a bad bitch. But again, I hope she's going to be worth it. I hope she's going to have your back like your wife had your back for the past 13 years. So anyways, y'all, let's go ahead and get the discussion popping. Go ahead and leave a comment. Let me know your thoughts on this entire crazy situation. Once again, concerning Jesse Williams, what do you guys think about what he said on Jay-Z's footnotes? And then also, what do you guys think about the new pictures surfacing today of him out on a date with Mika Kelly? So let's Let's go ahead and get the discussion popping. Don't so don't forget to hit that subscribe button, hit the like button, and don't forget to hit that bell so that way you can get all your notifications. So let's go ahead and get the discussion popping. Go ahead and leave a comment. All right, deuces. Hey you guys, it's your girl T. Make sure to subscribe, like, and share my videos. You can also visit lovelytea.com to purchase any merchandise. Also, don't forget to click the boxes down below to watch any of my previous videos. Talk to y'all later. Deuces.